Sikalanani, the Sikalaka word for unity, togetherness. For MassCom, the Batanani walk is about celebrating Batswana's spirit of coming together for the betterment of the community. This year in particular, the focus is on the urgent issue of protecting our children from all forms of violation. Through this discussion today, we hope to equip ourselves as caregivers, as parents, mothers, teachers, anyone who's a caregiver in any capacity with the knowledge and the tools to be able to protect our children. Now, we know we are in a pandemic and the government has put in place certain measures to curb the spread of COVID-19. Milha Gonzayalo, this has come with a few problems, well, actually big problems for children because it's exposed them to violation of all kinds, right? Now, this has come as a result of being separated from caregivers, schools being closed. I am Marang Salulwane, and today I am joined by brilliant minds who will guide our conversation on what exactly it'll take for our nation to be able to protect our children. Our stakeholders for today, we have from SOS, Mr. Johannes Buntluchile, Mr. Thabo Butelo, and from UNICEF, Me Homolemo Ra Si Si Ho. Hello. Hello. Oh, very welcome. <laughs> Thank They're you. going to share their insights on child protection, sexual abuse, social safety, mental health, and parenting during COVID. Mm. Thank you very much. It's a pleasure to have you here today. Um, this is a very imperative discussion that we're going to have on children. And in a space where they feel safe. You know, and I think as a community, as Botswana, especially during COVID, we really have to pull ourselves together. Especially um, COVID. Last year, the Botswana police they put out a report, and <laughs> out of 23 cases reported of sexual abuse within the first week of the lockdown, seven were children. Um, that is alarming. Yes. Let's get into child abuse. What constitutes as child abuse? Okay. Thank you very much for having us here today, Maran. Um, as mentioned earlier on, I am Homoli Morasi Child Protection Specialist from the Botswana UNICEF Country Office. Um, when we talk about issues that are violence against children, what is it? What, is, what constitutes it? Violence against children is any harm that comes to a child just because they are a child. Um, this can come in many forms. Um, it can be physical, it can be psychological, and it can be sexual. So as long as the intention um, of the perpetrator is to bring harm upon that child, yeah. we view that as being a violation against the child. Mm. Mm. But now, or just any caregiver, um, how do I recognize the signs and the types Okay. Um, but in, in different cases, it comes in different forms. Um, uh, for example, when you're talking about sexual, sexual violence, you find that um, your child can be can have sexually transmitted infections. Mm. Um, it's a really bizarre like the STI. Uh, a child falls pregnant at an early age. Yeah. Um, a child, the behavior, young one, when it comes to a child who is being sexually abused, learning, you can see from the from from the way that this child behaves. Mm. The child is very knowledgeable about issues that are sexually related. Uh, a child um, with um, that they acts depending on the age younger children can mimic the things the perpetrator has done to them mm. uh, physical violence is this the one that is usually very obvious to see because you will see the bruises um, the cuts uh, you will see the blue eye it, it shows um, in the physical and then we have the psychological most of the times it happens the words that are used, mobaneng, um, 
the demeaning words you know you 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 try to bring down a child calling a child stupid calling a child a donkey comparing them to you know yeah. those kinds of the, um, the, the 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 utterances saying what are adding as caregivers as people who live around bana it can be a teacher it can be a caregiver mm. so these are words you know what it's very difficult for you to see when a child is being psychologically abused because kana akere yona ha ina le body like the physical abuse That's like true. the sexual abuse where you can actually take a child to a doctor e ba khona gore ba identify the issues are gone now so the tahela as a parent we need as a parent we need to be very attentive yes because you can miss these things if you are not an, att- an attentive parent so go botho kwa hela thata gore re ithutele rona ka diotse gore re re khona gore di lemoge before they even go further So um me go mo le mona le bua ka bo attentive ba botsa ba botsa ba botsa and I want you to speak on you know what what parents or how parents should communicate with their children to get them to open up because you know you find what the closer the perpetrator is to the child the more difficult it is for the child to to speak out Emma so go re ke ba tlhore tsene go nne gore motsadi o simola ra ngwana re especially in a in a very cultured home where you know discussions or conversations around sex aren't mm-hmm. even had mm-hmm. Emma but i think the, the 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 most important thing is the relationship from the word go mm-hmm. because you can't wait for something to occur then expect mwana gore a open up yeah. when the entire time you have not been having that kind of relationship where you are able to open up so it's very imperative gore as we are raising our children we create a safe space for them we create a space in order they are able to converse with us on any issue mm. no matter how we feel embarrassing it is i think we are at a stage in our lives where we cannot afford to say there are embarrassing situations or there are embarrassing issues then or we cannot discuss lebana baron so when you have created that rapport that friendship lebana mm-hmm. they are able to open up and tell you when someone is doing something happen or now we have to educate them what about as a young person i don't want you talking to strangers if someone touches you in a certain way report this when this happens to you come and report it so go ira gore bana ba nne free go itse gore when they are here mo lapeng ga ba ke ke ba o mangedi wa gore ne ke ba lelela mama gore malume na ntshwara ka lebele na didn't like it but hela ha ile gore create environment tel no gore ha se ngwe se ira ga lla ngwana we are quick to put the blame on the child yes fa go ira gore ngwana ska bua ha ba nna le issue tsa ba di experience abo ba tshelo nga bona and then ngwana era yeah i think it's also worth noting that you have to teach the child from a young age mm-hmm. as young as 2 years old they should know that this is correct behavior and this is wrong behavior mm-hmm. because if you, they don't know by that age as you know that the perpetrators now are uh, are perpetrating on the younger ones yes. so if we don't get this, that knowledge to the younger ones they will never know and they, such incidents will become a culture for them and they will never know what what right and what wrong so better to teach the child while they're still young while they're still toddlers so that when they grow up they grow with the knowledge and they can really know how to react in every situation I uh, get the point that you've made because um interacting with my 2 year old I've realized that you know kids these days not even these days just kids from a young age they know what they want and what they don't want right and I recently read that as a parent you have to be conscious in how you even play with your child when your child does not want to kiss you do not kiss them mm-hmm. you know teach them that no is no Yeah no to avoid a situation where malome or auntie or, or whoever because I cannot be say to her like go rehela rata go remela ka go ba de tswale ka go go mme gore ha auntie kana ankele ya no ba re ba ntsuna in a way that is inappropriate no will mean no error mm. so i that's just something that i also want to share with other parents to to take note of that mm. teach your child no from no for no from yes from a yeah. very very early age mm. so how then do we what steps do we take after you've realized gore nya ke nnete ngwana ke o ntse a violate you the first step is to make sure that you don't don't try to watch the child just make sure that you take the child to the nearest police station or to the nearest hospital so that they can get the attention that's needed sometimes as parents we are concerned about making sure that the the child appears better when they go to such places mm. that's just making sure that the evidence will, will be will be washed away 
So mm. it's important that we take the child as they are to the nearest police and to the nearest uh, health facility so that they can receive the, the treatment and the services that they, they are needed. So such such would help that the, whoever the perpetrators are can can be apprehended for quickly and in the swiftest way possible. You know, these discussions are always very interesting because they're very, sometimes they seem very static or, you know, this, you go from A to B to C, but it's more complex than that, you know, especially in a cultural setup where, mm -hmm. let's say, malome or auntie, someone very close to you as the parent has done this, you know, how do we approach them, you know, from, from a familial um, point? Because that's now the part that we never really speak about, but it's so important. My advice always is when it comes to a child, everybody's a stranger. Okay. Treat, treat everybody the same. Do not be. Uh, so the first instinct would be to protect the child yeah. because that's the most vulnerable. They don't know what's happening and they're the most at fear and will never know what, what, how to react in a, a situation. So nobody matters except the, the welfare of the child in any situation. And their best interest are the utmost in such a situation. So whoever the perpetrator is, however their social standing or their political standing, if they are a leader in the community, make sure that the child is protected first then it would, everything else would have to, to come uh, at the back. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. Emma? Emma? Um, I, mean, Kirikare, I think what he has said is, is very correct. Like I said, when we were, when we were, we were, we were conversing earlier, that the problem is we should never ever try and place blame. Mm -hmm. Because once we start placing blame, yahore, um, this 13 year old, we see now we are shifting yeah. the attention where it's supposed to be. We are supposed to be concentrating more on this child has been violated. This child has been abused in a certain way. They've been taken advantage of. So as the older people, we are the ones who are supposed to be taking the responsibility. Mm. Put it over and above, Hore. How do I relate with this individual? How do I relate with this, um, you know, perpetrator? Yeah. That has to be secondary. The first thing has to be about the best interest of this child. Mm. And so, what other support can, can be given to this child? Because this is a very traumatic event that they've experienced, or you know, it's a very traumatic um, situation mm. for the whole family. Harutoho, as a family, what are the steps that we take for the child and for ourselves? What would be essential in such a situation is that the child has to have psychosocial support. Mm. They need counseling, intense counseling, not just a one-day talk and it's over. Because mm. these are scars that will remain with the child for the longest time, and. If you damage the child from a young age, they might never recover even as they are grown up. So it's better to get the child to the nearest social worker or any psychologist who can really attend to the child. And the family also needs to be involved in the process because if you remove anyone from the, the process, then you are leaving blank uh, gaps in the in the whole system so I it's think better to have skolo. yes mm -hmm. Kanangwano has been through something mm -hmm. like this you know lene lentse le le attentive le mo lebelle le mo yeah le mo yeah. attention yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. thank you so now but I'm um, sorry, before, um, before we move on, um, I think Hape, what we need to be also very careful on who we involve in the whole mm -hmm. situation because Ghana, remember, even if a child has been violated, they still re they still have their privacy okay. and we need to protect. So how you might do that and then this child is going to have a label. Mm. So that's why sometimes we need to see who are the trusted people by longer we feel correct. They can be, be they can be um, you know part of the healing process, young um, mm. because go go see has to be protected in this whole situation. Okay. Mm. So you yeah. child abuse. What measures have been put in place? What laws are there? So, <laughs> over to you. 
<laughs> okay. Um, I think in terms of Melaya Bujana, I think what what one can 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 say about Melaya and Abu Jana Gore, I think in terms of the Children's Act, we have one of the best acts, Molhati. Okay. Which the 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 whole purpose here, your name, to go protect the banner. Mm. Um, our our Children's Act is very detailed as to what it means. To it, long for the gate, the banner only. Um, who 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 violate your banner? Okay, hing, and it gives you. It clearly states what what needs to happen if a child is abused. Who needs to play what role? Um, you look at the you look at the um, the penal code. Al Hasilarona is very clear. Or when a minor, anybody who is under the age of 18 years, that is where we should also have started. Or Haribu Akangwana, or who is a child? Yes. Anybody who is under the age of 18, Al Hasilarona, Melayarna is very clear. Um, whatever abuse, Elon Horu, it is a mohene you face the law. Hi, mm. Lohore, you violate the law in any way. Okay. And what exactly, how are the punishment there when you perpetrate the lying? Legally speaking, um, legally speaking, it's uh, it's it's it, because how liberal or ne, how liberal or the Children's Act, it will show you how the how the people are going to Mm-hmm. The, the most important thing is rehabilitation. Because you can take someone for 10 years. Oh, the, the, the same thing. Because I think you you, you know um, some some social uh Ills, it's a mental illness. Yeah. So if you don't take that person through the process of rehabilitate, mm-hmm. you are still going to have a similar problem going forward. So when I learn element that rehabilitation, more um, than the system, which which we feel is something that we can still do a lot more. Or the perpetrate that are rehabilitate the way the kind of or the reintegrate the way into the society. Mm. Um, I think you also are aware of the sexual um, sexual sexual um, offenders registry. Yes. Yeah, what the country has just ascended to. Or we are going to be having a sexual offenders registry. High cover ba na hela, but rona mo kora because we are talking about children today. Um, it's something say long kore we we feel kore huwa ko twista to act as a deterrent. Or when you when you um, when you you violate any person sexually, your name is going to be in that register. So hardly be let's go no kore bana. Kanaro ba tohor ba tohay lohor ba toba bera kali bana. Kuchon lohor kie ko cheta kor. Ame marang ha yo moteng ha register ra. Because hai ke ba tohor kie expose ke nele crash ke be kia ko hira mo tohon lohor has got. Um, Case it's a it's a who abuse but not sexually. Case I check up on a more register and who are out there. So it's one of the 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 the, the, the systems that government has put in place. But no one like who are still let's say ban a baron. Hey, can I get now what's a COVID? Yeah, unfortunately, a lot of parents have lost jobs. You know, there's great distress in the household. Horribly, mm. okay, have been as attentive as they were before. Some children have been separated from their caregivers. You know, we're in a state of, of, of messiness, really, you know, for lack of a better word. Mm. Um, let's move on to another topic, you know, still within the area of child violation, child trafficking. Mm. Um, that one we don't speak about that often, but why mm. you know, it comes trafficking. It comes in different forms. There's mm. international variety, which is, you know, child trafficking through countries, mm. but while well, trafficking through countries. And then there's one that is culturally um, ingrained, right? So, for example, from mm. we assume as parents for better opportunities because this family can offer them a better life they're in a better economic standing mm. child labor mm. all the time especially mobile let's speak on that let's speak on child trafficking specifically what is it Anyone? can you take her <laughs> okay. Oh, oh. When we talk about child trafficking, we are basically talking about. I think we are dealing with hey. Can you child trafficking? No, you are moving a child from a familiar place of abode. You are taking them to an unfamiliar place for different reasons. Hey. People, most of the times, we are talking about for sexual gain, for sexual 
transactions for moelong gore ka motsa be ke muisa go boketeketa ha tsena kwa ena sexual slave um but ba duela and then they use this child anyhow um i think of, of recent if it's not this past month mo di khangetsa rona tsa botswana there was a case where a young girl was intercepted go border e le gore motho na mo tudisa border gore ra bata go muisa wherever and this child had been held captive Montunyamoto mm. before they then traffic them. So you see what these things then what as a country we've been thinking they are far fetched. Now it shows what they have come to our doorstep. Yeah. Um in Obuaka ene long gore ke ya within the country. It happens a lot. Gaza ma ke go tsa ngwana ko sojwe ke be ke re ke ra ba tsa di ba go ke reng ya this child is coming here ke tse ke tsilo go motsenya school. Kantele this child becomes a nanny. Kantele ke a mo ntsha ibile ke bile go monela mo thomo go gore tsa we go we go a go go belegela bana. You don't even know gore ngwana o ha tsena ka go ira ga lang ka yena. So it's 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 happening a lot within our country. The same applies ka bana ba 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 ile gore ke ba di sa ba that one will form more hard still work a kind of child labor. But me hela yona trafficking it's becoming more and more um you know apparent mo la sen la rona. And I think it's 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 also being go go ke di a thata ke ganyo ne a gore ya ka no bua gore it's 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 a mess everywhere yeah. parents are preoccupied hari tsore bana ba rona ba diraeng gore these issues how go kwa itsa as a stand alone um gona le issues a gore bana ba rona spending a lot of time in the internet we don't even know gore ba bua le bomang khante lo utwa go tenya wa go kopa ke go kopana le simamang ha le go ira go ira go ira go ira this child doesn't even have a face behind the person wa bua le ne behind the screen so bana ba hela ba na vulnerable we know gore there were people ba ile gore no go teba tsa maka dikolo imo the grab kids gore ba ba isa kae you you wouldn't know so kanya trafficking is a very concerning issue and i think the good thing is that as a country we do have the act that in order to ban sexual contact trafficking of persons okay. um so ke ngwa do tsedile ka ngwana go deter e bile ga pa thing go nna re ntsiri bua ka gone go a educate because most people are not aware o gona mo ithala mo se mo go la setse gore eh mo tlo gona o tsa ngwana ba misa South Africa gore ngwana wa go thola ntse le khoba a sa itse gore do tse di tenda ira ga ene kana you know khanya ya gore e be re tsa ngwana re muisa go a gona le masika ke so se se diragala it's been happening it's, yeah. it's part of our culture you know mm. i get it rare it takes a village to raise a child but mm. when your child is within you know the the the, the presence of other people are they protected mm. you know le ha ile gore that's your sister or your brother or mang yeah. are they really really you know doing what they should be for for that child rebun tlogile how can we protect our children from child trafficking Hey, as it has been alluded earlier, but what we need to do is to know what our children are doing, who our children are with, and who they are communicating with. Just get involved in your child's in your child's life, mm. and the people that your child interacts with, mm. you need to also be able to know who they interact with. Mm. So I believe that in that way you can be able to. play a certain role in in protecting really it's it's not that easy it's very difficult because sometimes even those that you believe you trust yeah mm. can be the ones who end up you know uh trafficking your child but as it was alluded earlier getting involved in your child's life is the most important thing mm. and knowing their whereabouts mm. yeah yeah whereabouts ke ra taka gore ke ba tlo botsa ka yone yana gore um earlier on you mentioned gore kana go gatlo gona le batho dikoloetse di tsambana ya no re boela mo go ya protection gore where are the hot spots or what are the activities that can lead to your child being trafficked er emma Mm. <laughs> you know the, the hot spots nowadays is everywhere yeah. it's 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 practically everywhere yeah. but you can't even say go di barang because di barang ntse di tsotso so go ntse go sebe gone go re simola go bana di khantsa traffic ndo o ketsega di ntse di tsotso yana so schools for example lo khona go di kolone le gone bana ba bang ba khona gore ba dirisiwe hela ke ba gholohela gore ba lo already tsala tsa bona gore ba hela ba tsana hela ka the same thing ira ga la ka di drugs where it's brought in by one student so it is a possibility and i think one thing happened ke gone gore Kana Botswana is being used as a corridor ya go traffic ka bana. 
I don't know how many cars have been intercepted. There was a combi under 10 years. So it's, it's, it's really a scary situation for us as a country. So specifically, we have to be very vigilant because it happens in the whole water. A perfect example would be yeah, go to the Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Imagine it, 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 mm-hmm. you know, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Can you advise parents on how to to maybe avoid such situations maybe hakiti name tags what how how can we how can we prepare our children in fact yes how can we prepare prepare our children for such for such um instances where when they are approached by someone mm-hmm. The yeah. is education. Yeah. Mm. Education, you can never overemphasize mm. issue or educate yes. the people. Mm. Because once you have educated the you have given them the power over themselves. Mm. They know. But in, in most instances, don't talk to strangers. Yes. Mm. You come to them, a stranger. You see now, that is where, that is where we need to hammer Kenya. Yeah, 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 yeah. Education more than baron. Um, you know, like earlier on when you said you are a mother, and and sometimes these issues they 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 become so personal. You know, I have a 13 year old, and it worries me. For one note, I'm a guy on a level of man who is rather lay. And when I feel like I'm a pastor, for why is this person always on my case? I get so I get small soon. To when I was talking to him, I was like, "Oh, don't ten minutes. I get small soon. Because ten minutes has been too long. You know what's happening? So those that we need to be concerned as parents. There is a lot of luxury, especially look at my hair. Or go to Anka Tano to look at a five-year-old. Oh, I know how me is. I love us. Hamika. Oh, I know why. Haka eleven in a row. It's a road. So these are not. This, these are the kind of behaviors that we need to be um, discouraging. More about adding. Parents have to be very, very vigilant. We have to be very vigilant. We have to be very vigilant. We have to be very vigilant. Yeah, because mm. also, you know, we are living in a changing world. So it's no longer Anka Nabu. More thing, you know. Uh, re 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 masika ha bona me hale kana re hale ke ra you know anyone any lady any man any woman is your mom or your daddy no it's no longer like that mm. because the people that you think are older and there are people you can trust are the ones also by lengore they can end up uh perpetrating you know so i really agree with her in, term, in, in on the issue of educating our children or they are not supposed to go with any stranger anywhere or even talk to anyone and they should be able to act you yeah. know, to say mm. no i see you run away i act there I see you. I see you. I see you. I see Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. From a very young age, I have a lot of practice. What's your mom's name? Mm-hmm. Yeah. What's your dad's mm-hmm. name? Mm-hmm. Number. Mm-hmm. You know, where do you look? Where those, that information. Mm-hmm. From somewhere. Mm-hmm. That's true. Yeah, trafficking, because people often think that it's a far fetched yeah. thing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Every day, you yes. go all mm-hmm. the time. Mm-hmm. Let's unpack it. What is child labor? So that child labor, when we talk about child labor, we are talking about an instance whereby um, a person who is under age, like I said earlier on, under the ages of 18, 18. years, who is supposed to be in school, is now taken for a job and it's going to bring in an income. We need to differentiate this because that is not child labor. But as long as there is a monetary incentive behind... <laughs> I like that. <laughs> ...behind... That is child labor. Hey. Mm. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Hey, can I, can I, I know, I know what about another man is doing. I'm going to talk to you. Mommy, this is a child labor. Can I go and buy the channel or something? So the legal age for one of us in Malawi is 18. Yes. So any amount, they can start earning any amount from 18, as long as halai beraka kota boko sena matata. And then what is the role of UNICEF in fighting child labor? So that is our role um, in conjunction with other UN agencies, saying what they are by right to like ILO, the International Labour Organization. Kanyar na ki kyo educate about to kadi kanza child labour. Kanyar na ki kuto sala hasi to make sure the hasi has me lao in place, saying what they prevent our child labour irahal. And also in 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 conjunction with different partners. Relika ko na where we know where there are hotspots. Ko ikaw na ko na di hotspot thing that child labour. Especially along the border villages, um, go the blessing, um, go elu ngor kui pitilenga na te. Kiko na ko itelenga elu ngor child labour in Nancy te. So rona relika ko na ngor reeducate ba to relika ko retuisa ba to ngor. But halo kanya so di kanza elu ngor when we are talking about child labour, raburi bua kahai. And then how can one deter one from child labour? Arete. Uh, deterrence is another aspect say, in that, <laughs> because you can imagine that somebody who has monetary mm. incentives mm. for mm. for for one o and the most idea hela le na if you have one o kaze nyama match you can have a lot of problems with that day. So the, the 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 concept of education is always important. Or the one about the debate or how the how did the how did the jalo oto la mola. And repercussions that think it didn't change. I want to tell you that I didn't know how to feel or okay. More for our house, I see. Me, I like what I'm going to do. But I didn't know anything. I'll let her go. I'll 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 so I get that separate all together from child labor. Mm. When I was trying to go, go back to my life, being a mother, do come on, have been in a career. No, because sometimes children get confused. Mm. Mm. This allowance is separate from yeah. your chores at home. Yeah. Mm. Chores are chores. Like you could say, you could be some working, can you could be some blessing. As long as kids are good, really. When I'm like being my break, the 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 definition has to be very clear. Yeah. You know, the differences. Mm. I think I think I think you have you have you have nicely. Separated the two mm. because how much but what kind of people who are not confused in any way? I mean, what is child labor? I mean, child labor as long as hella or 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 some other or what? But when we believe how we believe how we do it, but now hella like a mad. How we do it? Any kind of key key monster? How we talk about how we like how hard you show your your incentive? You know what I mean? Kill you. But when I heard this child is supposed to be in school. This child is of school going age, but because le mozeri le mui sita to a different environment, para kora no wano ori mu dina ya opportunity ya kore ukaba kote na schoolo abai tu taka musaba abereka all of the appropriate age. Yes. Um, we tell elo kore how we because the parents buy abereka. Mwana yo utale bone. Kya pata kanya kote ya no mozadi le mwana both zone ke buy abereka. So this is now where the aspect of Horano. Yeah, you see, I mean, of legal age, but you know, you have of legal age. How to not have a bali when you have anything at that particular point in time. Janu me humole mo. Let's take example. Yeah, myself, for example, I started working at eleven. Would that be considered child labor because I was getting paid? And their children, lima butzana, and just across the world, who start working maybe on television, radio. You know, especially in the entertainment industry, who start from a young age and do get paid, mm. what do we classify that as then? Um, I think what are the conditions? Mm. Because obviously when you are that age, your parent has to consent mm. to you doing this. And they have to be there all the time, making sure what the other doesn't disturb the other. Hi, look, Rikki. Ha, I'm doing this for a certain period of time. Me ha get so high get some like well as kolong. Um, hasiru etsi look, Rikki. Di 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 ra Rikki. Ma bosolo ba me bocho ta ko ta. Koneli friction. Koneli friction in between. Ma ban. Kanya ro na ina ko ramo ina ko rano. The other thing ano ira ko ramo ko ngoko safari mo bosolo mbangwa. Eh. So that is where we now um bring the the differentiation. There has to be a parental consent. Kana mo kumi bloko ira ko ramo zaidi asa consent. Kuti lela ka tenga ngo nuki ako mazenga skolo. Hats and aqua, one on a maid. Hats and aqua, one hour on a mudis. 
kena nonga thokomela ba gago e na setse ne skoro eh eh kantsa power le tsone di diameter ka gore kana yo mongwe ga ya lo ga ha consent ha kgone gore la go ntsa ngwana ha file gore ngwana wa ya no is getting too much so lo go nomo go ametar gore when the power imbalances are there then you know that probably child be go na te when when you are waking ama ha yo mama re nyane go ne ke file re ngwana ga is just they are taking a lot of the head time so when that the parent has that power then we to okay then consent has been really been ineffective so ke le marang ke khona go lemoga ha ja re tengile gore go ha go na le you know suspicious activities happening involving wana and go ngwana wa bere ka go ja re tengile ke report ta kae ke bua le mang you know how ke gore ke lemoga yang gore go ha go na le child labor go ha I think the first point of contact really it's 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 you can talk to law enforcement because kha nya ya child labor it does fall within their jurisdiction yeah. you talk to the social worker because how do aka kha nya protection abana they are the first point of contact mo kha nya ntse le gore ke tse di amane le bana bone they know how they will investigate this issues further gore ba bona gore amme go ya child labor ene gore ya diraga the type like rata kgeng ya buang gona ya gore ha ke bona sengwe se sanna sente ke be ke reporta because the children's act clearly states gore ko e leng gore ke bona molato irwa against ngwana ke be ke didimala i am going to be held liable as much as the perpetrator gore whether it's sexual abuse happening to a child whether it's me ke hirile ngwana ebe wena o le mara ngwe itse gore go mo le mo dira o bo di dimasa hela ha go ta go tsa to light gore you knew na lo ena re face amela to e tshwana so it's very important for but not out there to know gore it's their responsibility to report when they see violation happening against one ba ska ba tshaba ha ke ditsene ga tlo le ha ke ditsene ga tsene mo life ya ngwana ha etsena nteng tsena lo ena teng go show that the child is protected when we began our discussion nerubuaka child abuse i want us to now zone in particularly more sexual abuse what is sexual abuse nangwana are se moleka age gape khanya age and khanya consent gape let's define those sexual abuse to be is molela gona ya ka nerubuaka di moka di mo gatsa ngwana gore be below 18 years ha le ga ha o tsena le ngwana o ile ka thobalo khotsa ka bo pornography khotsa ka go ka go motshwara ka halo re ga ga ile tse ka teng that is sexual abuse so hela go thelela halo re ngwana tota bile re dumela gore ngwana ha ke a gore a re ntshware go tota hela hela ga ngwana le bilo 18 ha go re dumela gore ha ke a ba gore a re tshwara re tshwara ne ya so go ke bile gore go you are violating the child sexual ke gona sexual abuse re ntse re marketing go eh e tla ke la la ngwana re le yes ratana <laughs> kemola to because you're not supposed to be gore tana le ngwana o 17 years yeah do hare le belela khangele gore gongwe the age difference gona go therela gore ke bana bo theka bo beti then that is when mola o gona gore o nne a bit lenient gone ho gore kara these are two people ba le gore di ngwaga tsa bone um ke bana bo othi so ke khanya gore ba bitjo ba khale meme okay ne ke ba ta go botsa gone mo gore ha ile gore bothe ba under 18 re re tsa tsa ya ke gone gore ba khalemelwe e ke gone gore khanya teng ya no gore kana da both minors you can't say ke go ke go tsha tsha ngwana mosimane ka gore ke na re leng then gore gore ano ano go tla bo gonna le 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 discrimination e diragala you can't say ke tsha tsha ngwana mosana ka gore o rile so there is the, the, the law then um e gone re be na bit lenient on 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 them gore nya me kana khanye ke bana bothe this is not supposed to be happening ya no design tsa teng re tlile mogaya are are tse ya ya di sign tsa tsa sexual abuse gore o khone go le mogare ngwa no me has been violated re di bona ya so i think uh you know the obvious one ke one physical 
you will see gore ngwana mo khona ra ba sa tsamaisin the wa bona o bona gore me go ha ka ha tsamang ka teng o ka tswa anali injury in a private uh, area wa bona and then also le emotional ngwana te o khona go na withdraw mo yo long gore ga you know ga ga sa thola ali u mo itse gore ke ngwana o hype ke ngwana o active but the child becomes very 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 withdrawn and and moody and so angry so these are the things they long gore ditabo di go supens ha gore eh eh something is wrong here mm. you know mm. eh so then you definitely need to do something about it mm. uh, the moment you see uh, such baba ngwe they can be very violent you know just turn around and really be very violent and hate certain people if you are a man they start hating you because mm. a man has violated yeah. the right yeah. behavior yeah. 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 yeah yeah and it's all because yeah. of sexual abuse and yeah. the child has not you know spoken mm. out about it mo go mo iteleng bile go go tsosa ke gore bana ba bona kana da introverts ka bo boy so ga zemo go tenya ngwana bile o change it ngwana o ntsantse jalo jan to gona ra ring involvement tap on side e to gore be nine lati involvement da ga ya go abwe re do tse dinitsi ka go pepetrisa se tsone dia go le mo ga tsone gore ngwana o ha le ga buile batho ba o mae solita motho ke gona ba o mitirelang mathata teng go nngwe so do not make sure gore or always make sure gore ya ya aware of your child's needs kana go ngwe le ngwe ha le behavior and mm. attitude mm. Mm. gore o mo observe around different yeah. people in different mm. environments mm. Yeah. Hello. Mm-hmm. And what are the what are some of the effective ways of protecting your child? When I asked this question, um I remember when we were growing up, my grandmother na se parida. Boys baroba la caja, girls baroba la caja. And only now I used to wonder why. Do go neke wana go le so one fair because we all just want to play mm-hmm. together. Only now in my adulthood, you know sometimes but they divide red line, they don't have to explain it. They know why. Maybe that wasn't the reason, but as a parent in hindsight got actually you know maybe that was her way of just reducing the chances of any uh, activity sexual activities happening you know mm, between mm. the boy child and the girl child mm. um i want your take on it what are what are some of the effective ways that you can recommend <laughs> that parents protect their child from sexual abuse hey mm. i'd say this, this this is a very complex <laughs> complex issue that we are discussing here mm-hmm. but me aka o bua gore gore you can only Try. Try. You can yeah. only try and and hope for someone to stay with her. Me hello, but I can't even ring talking to kids about these issues. Um, educating them about, you know, and and nowadays I think the good thing is that we do have, um, you know, simple booklets saying what they are there. We are not going to write it, but they are not parallel. Okay, so I don't want if I don't want someone touching me like this. Mm. And 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 also I think colleague are correct. On a very or very observant as a as a parent, more behavior in young one. Now, any slight change, we will go and we pick a couple. We will go and we 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 address it there and there. Um, more on how to pay a couple. We are going to go and we will 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 go so you have to avoid taking bana go lengore that uncomfortable ka go ya teng um where possible there are places tseno gore you need to avoid go tsa male bana go go tsone we as i know as adults rata di party tsa rona ba ha o ha o sna and then you feel compelled to get tsa male ngwana go ikutuka go kile ngwana go di party go go no one thing go lengore can't let people lose their minds they don't even know what they are doing can't let go ithela motho le go ro party se di tsa ngwana ha go mo khone so we have to try and avoid mahelo a ntsenya lo a ile gore a ka a ka nna true i think i think also one of the the the, the things that you know the tv programs that mm-hmm. they label 
seleng go ra lebella mwana a le ho and they are seeing those activities and you find that the child can be able to even practice that with other kids mm. what they saw on tv so we really need to also put those restrictions motive ya ga go dira lotela those adults eh wa wan eh di boele bo anti le le di program tse tse lo re bana ba tshwana di lebella wa di lotela ha ya teng ga ka ya access wa access a di popa he so you need to do those things so that the child will stay safe You know. I guess the same thing mm. with Maranya. Ni kana ba malatsinga ba ba mo di laptop o ba mo di iPading, you know, mm. the tablet, the ba nile access to the internet. What are they exposed to mm. yes. online? Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. I think also what we need to really take note is that boys can be sexually abused. I think khantsi re lena re le ba la gore ba simane le bone ba khona nna di victim ta abuse. Re nna re o re focus ata ta mo ba setsane then basimane go tswa le bone ba pollo ke go open up about issues ka or ba ka nya re go ngota go tena na ba le participants instead of for na ba abuse you e se go ba ka abuse wa ke ba nna hela le ba sa di ba khona go abuse ngwana le ene o khona go wa mosimane khona o tshoroka ha sara teng ka teng go tswa khona o sunwa ka hana sa ba teka teng so such issues ga re le tsone re nna re ntse re ba le ka re rute ba tsadi gore o se ka ka nya re ka go ngwa re ka re khona ba setsana mo lapeng gore a re bana ba go ka sene di victimize sexual abuse mm. always be weary lo khona gore bana ba ba simane le bone ba khona nna di victim i think in communication ga pese se bo thokwa ke gore i read gore o tshontse go bole o tshontse go ruta ngwana ga go di body parts tsa gagwe o mo rute ngwana mo setsana gore mo ke mo mo ke mo mo ke mo ngwana mo simane mo ke mo mo ke mo mo ke prop when a prop properly properly um yeah. i know unicef has a book on on that body parts mm. and i like that book i have it for my daughter as well and i want to share it with her because gore gone ho o ka bontsha ngwana gore ha ha go tshwarwe ha ha go asiam mo ke se even when they interact with their age mates ba khone go itse gore ka gore ke itse re le batsa di ngwa wa batsa wa bathapisa ya la botena ko ile wane wa batshasa ya la botena ko ile wane also just speaking on that what is the right age to to separate the genders you know because it's it's a thing you know gore bana ba go thapiswa up until ba le how old ba go interact gore ba sa par up until how old you know you know it's a it's a it's a it's a it's a imanga nganyana because when we are when we are trying to socialize bana ba rona we are trying to teach them gore they are equal gore ha ke ba tlo go nela separation a gore o la re na ke ngwanyana na ke mosimane na ka re na ka re how to go like how it can be very dicey you are trying to bring them up together to respect each other gore ha ba gola yana ba itse gore um o ke ngwana mo setsana o ke ngwana mosimane but we are we are two sides of the same coin we have to coexist because how when the separation ha pe ke one ira gore go ne le cure set gore ke eng ha ba mo separate o le ba mako yo le ba ring o le ba ring so it it needs to be handled with care um situation ya te and then how we are kanya di body parts gore it's very critical gore ruta bana di body parts you know some cases tsa go police re khona go fediswa la gore ngwana na re na ntsho re ka kuku and then somebody says but you don't have a cake, a cake there's yeah. nobody part of you and the law yeah mm. wow. and so it is very important for ruta but another right terminology for these body parts i know it can be it can <laughs> sound it's not palatable to yeah. the ear yeah. it's something that needs to happen go to call a spade a spade you need to call you a spade a spade especially how ko 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 ri phitha rangena gore ngwana is facing molao ngwana has to give evidence because if they give evidence in a certain way go gona re be le gore di case di hella di pala because ngwana ha bo ise se iragetse hmm ke na kwa covid and a lot of our children are learning virtually um a lot of parents are at home le bone mo di ipad ng gore olokwa 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 our children have tablets they exposed to the internet these ones are very fast when i said that and i said that i need 2 years old so it's youtube go re ntse ya na ntse ya na let's talk about child cyber crime because i think again much like child trafficking but i not tend to think it's a far fetched idea hai kwano mm, mm. Cyber crime, 
So the we were talking about cyber crime rubua ka ka me la toeleng gore ke itebagantseng le tsa borenyane me ke boela ka sona rmo tsana go gheta e thalogane rubua ka me la toeleng gore ke itebagantseng le tsa borenyane e leng gore e e taka me thale e harogane um cyber crime when we are looking at the issue ya bana we are looking at where people can actually groom bana that is what we call grooming and gore it happens within the cyberspace mm. where someone usimola atsenya ngwana into conversation ne khantele ngwana o setsa simola go divulge information mo motongo o setse bila mahadi house number gore ke nna kopo ke teketa ke nna smamma nke ring ke ring ke ring ke ring um the cyber crimes tele ngotse ngwe gore there are monetary related where people can actually hack into account get your monies and do what have you and um you find gore batho ba bangwe ba 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 ke gona kwa eleng gore ba gona re be ba tsa bana from from the cyber space e be ba hella bana ba ba abuse bana ba sexually uh because ba 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 attractile from the cyber space so it's one of the issues tseleng gore tota ha re bua ka 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 online safety ya bana it's very critical gore di discuss especially mo na konya go mpeno ya covid em ba kopana ka ile bana ba in the cyber space yeah facebook Uh, your Twitters, your Instagram, your TikTok, your whatever you name it, mm. where interaction can happen. Modi social media platforms. Bakopa na le bona go nko. And most of the time, re le batsadi, we don't even check. Yeah. Ngwana ha re ke ra home ke wa re yo 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 hela ba hile sko ba hile tiro go skolo, nte ke saka mo disturb. You don't even know go ngwana o le beletse. E lona. Re bontse ke le. Em. You look like you want to add to it. Mmele wa na re tota wa dinalana erra. Eh no I was I actually agree with her you know um there was this time I saw a story of this uh organization bane ba ba treka di tsone di bone di perpetrators ba long ko dei they 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 organize these things with the kids mm-hmm. and this person person put a uh, uh, sort of a portfolio a itira ngwana mm-hmm. you, you know and they they did make up about about the age the guy was able to confirm or she's you know she's 15 and they met at a hotel you know and that's when they apprehended this guy mm. you know and so he had to face that so these things are really real mm. so they did that well, wanna to just to get to these guys and to mm. be able to catch them so we really need to be careful for bana ba rona mo facebook ba chata le bomang you know and the kind of things that they see you know for me right now i have a child but he's is growing but what i do i download stuff for him and then i keep him out of the internet he can play whatever games offline but that's that's what i try to do yeah the game me lo ne me you find that there are games where they can interact yeah. with people from wherever mm. yeah. um yeah. and i think much like so any social media as parents we also have to interrogate yeah. those games mm. download the game play the mm. game yourself or not have the koha go diragalang they they common games that i know right now are trending um for in well in the children's space mm-hmm. and let's on a hurry they're very dangerous mm-hmm. and you know like how these people kana kana you know criminals are also clever it's not like we are dealing with kaka brainless people yeah. they also know hurry what is going on how le ka go thiba ha they find a loophole mm. and baba when you see hurry go be ka di syndicate it's not even an individual it's a whole syndicate of people mm. by no hurry they are they are making sure hurry they will reach to this children hurry come come hail and whatever yeah. they will make sure hurry they come into contact le bana and most of the time kana wa wa go tla le hurry this is just the first step towards another crime like what trafficking ya kana re bua so it's very important hore hore re ne re itse hore bana ba rona ba dirain mo ka go spentsa nga la ke gona hore wa bona re batsadi ke bo bona ela they have put the fall victim a lot to to cyber crime so how bona batsadi ba gona hore bona with their wisdom and everything ba gona fall a victim bana bona ba haka yo no hore yep with the lord by to trusting with everything i want to ke 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 maloma ho was the information er ke o malo mo ka mpona kwa ta ta ntse so is so we na gore go nna motho gore ba kgone gore ba ba fole victim so we really should be always attentive to our children that every to the sport is bale mo go sone le rona bere le kgone go teng and maybe also limiting screen time yeah mm-hmm. yeah. yeah limiting screen time 
tsa di di iPad di tablet the di di laptop di tswale have some play play games yeah. with your mm. child you know interact with your child yeah mm. um child support systems mm. which ones are available mo botswana are we tataka sos and wow. what do you do right well with child support systems as as we we really do try to really be out there in the communities we have the what we call the family strengthening program where we go out into the communities our aim is mostly that where families might are at risk of breaking apart we try to move those families together so that children don't end up losing out on their family time or end up being placed in places of safety like SOS. Mm. So our aim is always to empower those families. If there the issues of uh, violence in the families, we try to make sure that we rehabilitate the families so that they can really reconcile and be able to really take care of the children. So we do this in, with, uh, with, in, in conjunction with agencies in the communities. We, we use the VDCs, we use the churches, we use the COSI so that we know that it's not just a, a family thing or a child thing, but mm. it's a community thing. Because mm. where the community is mm. really involved, then there are less incidences of crime that can that they can occur, especially in, in the interest of children. So, because you used that example, how do you think it's an SOS? Yeah, maybe uh, if for, for a child to come to SOS, uh, they are brought uh, by a court order. Okay. What happens is that uh, social workers in that area, let's say Okosujwe, then the social workers in that area, they have to go and do an inquiry. Mm. And then they find that this child needs a safe place. They need to be moved out of this place because it is not good for them. They are in danger. So what they do is they uh, get a court order for the child and then they bring the child to SOS. So we keep children who are actually brought in by mm. the government yeah, through a court order. So you cannot just come and drop a child. Yeah. You know mm. what I mean? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then how many families have you helped? How many children have you helped? Currently within the SOS uh, program, we have over 400 children. And within our family strengthening program, we have one over one one thousand five hundred children that we are helping their families to really uh, come back together. So that's how how spread our programs are. Okay. And in what way does that help come in? Like how how do you help them? Okay. With with our family uh, family strengthening program. We are really trying to avoid children being taken into SOS. Mm. Okay. But uh, that's more of a preventative measure for us. Mm. But the, when children are brought into uh, places of safety, that's when the, the families have broken down and there are issues of uh, sexual abuse so that have been perpetrated on children, violence on children, or some, some are abandoned by the, the caregivers. That's when they are brought into SOS for, for care by our SOS uh, mothers. Okay. Mm. And what kind of help can the community give you as SOS? Yeah, so uh, really the community uh, has many different players, really. Uh, we have um, religious, you know, uh, organizations. We have corporates. Religious organizations, children need uh, re uh, spiritual development. Mm -hmm. It's part of a, a child's development that we believe that religion can really tackle. And we also have uh, corporates where we believe that they can come on board to actually partner with SOS on a long-term basis to support the programs that we are doing, whether it be it financially or even through uh, corporate um, uh, volunteering. You know, we, we, we encourage uh, corporates to come and volunteer, even people out there to come and volunteer so that they, they come in and they feel Mm. and they see and they experience what really SOS is all about. Because there is, um, you know, there is a, a notion out there that SOS is a wealthy organization. Mm. So once you mm. come into SOS, then you see what SOS really is. Then you see the need. Then you are able to say, oh, okay, they really have needs. Yeah. And this is how I can come in. So we believe that uh, you know, individuals, families, they can come on board, 
su support the child. You can just come and say, okay, I'm going to, to take care of this child. I'll meet their needs, whether randomly, whether monthly, or whichever way you can, really. So what we are asking is that let the whole community come on board and help SOS care for the children. That's what we say. Contact details? Uh, the contact details, see, uh, you can uh, reach us or uh, our telephone is 395 3220. Uh, or you can uh, email us uh, go uh, info.fdc at sos botswana.org. And SOS only helps children under the age of 18. Yes specifically 18. Yeah. Okay. I'm just interested in knowing what is the rehabilitation process as well, we wrap up. Yeah. Once we bring a child into SOS, let's say be two years old, you can imagine that a child who's been separated from their parents can have, really have the most uh, productive life, if, if you can imagine. So. We try to make sure that the child is get holistic development. We give them emotional development, uh, physical development, just making sure that they, they receive all the love that's needed, especially our SOS mothers. Mm -hmm. So how I did the 20 years. school this has been a, a very insightful and educational conversation. Um, I appreciate you. Mascom appreciates you for all the work that you're putting into protecting our children mm -hmm. and for joining us today for this discussion. I think in the spirit of Batanani, mm -hmm. <laughs> let's call upon Batwana to assist UNICEF, assist SOS, assist any organization in your community yeah. that's helping children in any capacity whatsoever. Thank you so much for joining us today. I am Marang Selulwane, and it's been a pleasure having this discussion with our lovely stakeholders. Remember, Batanani Mascom Batanani Walk this year is all about protecting the children. Bye. To note, let's head over to the next studio to enjoy music from the sheer talent that is William Last KRM. Yeah, it's the William to the last, bro. Everything happening, done pray for. I will take it to the top like a top dog. Then I beat my chest like King Kong. People say my face got a built on. Everybody saying that little don't go up. How the hell you talk crap about me, bro? Please, next thing when you see me, go by photo. Okay, I stand up by myself on the bottom. All my fake friends for the past had to cut them. These days, focus on the prayer and the Bible. Did I like a little on a dude who pushes I'm a rabble? My father always told me before I'm a rabble. 
Bare ke mo rwalo ko sikela ne ke vake sa batle me bitsholo ke kolelela nkhone ko tirong ko le nkwalo my brother always told me you got to roll a dice oh you gonna pay the price you got to be a thug so them that you got pride Cause these humans ain't nice They be yet to let the levy They just wanna see you dead All the negatives them take them to the head You know sometimes life just ain't fair Can we leave the fact that my uncle is dead? Yeah. Turn off the music, silence my thoughts, yeah Uplift yeah. my spirit, make me a force, yeah. yeah Never think I'm bad I never put myself on no pedestal Cause I know how it feels to be lonely I get at the Ruski, my lay, but to Baba to Mille, the Bethicket that the Humile, Hajahana, I'm a trotter to the Dalla City Sokola, never give a lachile, Kola Pin, Hajiba Lebalatat. All I think about is house my mom. I'm just hoping that the days increase still longer to see her granddaughter grow up. Uh, yeah. All I ever wanted was to be a dad. Hoping that my child never see me mad To the mom, best thing that I ever had If I killed your dreams, that's my bad Yeah, she ain't never play hard to get mm. That's why I had a hollow back I ain't really tryna break, not get right ahead I get at the jab and jab and got a dollar mag Okay, cause get like nigga gow long gows Science teacher and I rat a hun clown Every time I think about it, got a guy cowl Yeah, keep play fella once unannounced I'm just hoping when I die, I give a little hell Now get up a lot, that's it till it been They probably think it's like sitting in the city Yeah, bro, please, William, let's do bless it Turn up the music, silence my thoughts, yeah Uplift my spirit, make me a force, yeah No, no, no Never think I'm bad, I never put myself on no pedestal Panda. These days trying to take it to London Woke up in the morning, I was feeling like my bitch, yeah Woke up in the morning, I was feeling like my bitch, yeah William to the left, so you over Put up at your house with a bone up If you owe me, don't I better pay up Tryna get the back by Q5 All these fake boys, they bone me What the hell, they acting khaki Got a chick call a pain, she wifey Talk about the money, yeah, ready, seem dizzy Don't judge me, hack it up, hella uh, Them tryna kiss me, got it kakana uh, All of my boys keep a pamela uh, Not all of them, some of them mm. I ain't take a bath in a while I've been looking for the money, not dice Everybody wanna talk about the price I'll get the price and buy Talk about the money, don't forget about me, forget about me. Wanna make a budget on a bigger level yeah. I'm a type of rapper, talk about the money Oh, bro, bro, wanna talk about me, they really get it I could pull up in the stools, I fall All oh, you broke niggas, this come papella yeah. All of my boss, they broke your cellar Tryna get zaga Get skin my lip, I find a body that I really Baba Jendi, Zolo, get high, yeah Now your yeah. boss, I really, really Kick your boss like Caliph yeah. As a bleep, don't hate me, man When I'm limon, I'm tryna list a ton You want the beef, better think again I won't stop till I make a meet All I ever do, just wonder, just wonder. I put it out like thunder, thunder. Being couple of skip panda. panda These days, tryna take it to London yeah. Woke up in the morning, I was feeling like my bitch yeah. Woke up in the morning, I was feeling like my bitch yeah. Yo, wait, ah, Lapa's corner Spoon my corner, ah, spoon my corner, boom nandini ni so tola, ah, lapas corner, ah, spoon my corner, ah, 
La mascone boom na dini ni chokola Kena le ngwana mpana kiriana Mago le zoti khasi motwana Bua lulo na marata di tabe Nkeshi tiki ndake tababa nyana Every Sunday kai tepel Munchala kabulo yi kao betel Ki mutu na fele tante kai belel Limi le buru tela relel All my boss in the KY Pull up in the Andrews in the Hondais Back then spalle li di kondai These days they talk about Dubai Some of these rappers kidi popai Bina tabo na khadi qualify Banta nye mogo tona I don't mind Ba ito oni biti mola ya Salaba dala ma demo Umbona na gira na ki kudo Ke bo khali mo ki to kampilo Didi biti para fina mo lelo Baya biza ma gama Zambo nani ma kala Baya kala ya khala Baya kala ya khala Ke prata slongo yo palo I pus pus yo malo To be honest ya dala To be honest ya dala All I ever wanna do is pull up in it Audi Now I pull up in it Hey I'm feeling rowdy All I ever do just wonder, just wonder. I put it out like thunder, thunder. Being couple ask it panda, panda. These days trying to take it to London. Woke up in the morning, I was feeling like my bitch. Yeah. Woke up in the morning, I was feeling like my bitch. Yeah. Yo, wait. Ah. Lapas corner. Ah. Spuma corner. Ah. Spuma corner. Boom na dini ni so tola. Ah. Lapas corner. Ah. Spuma corner. Now my scone boom na dini ni chokola All I ever do just wonder, just wonder I put it out like thunder, thunder Being couple ask you panda, panda These days trying to take it to London Woke up in the morning, I was feeling like my bitch Woke up in the morning, I was feeling like my bitch Yeah, yeah, wait Ah They tell you, you tell about bitch I'm a bitch about honey But sweet to the zaka The tena or raka the sofa The bill you do dollar Your mama to me to the tala The fake it the bata Fambola oh fambola Tata but never about to So they cursing you Baba the old taka Si Then I learn what I got Baby the taro get Taba bukete Si These days all my fans Baba I can drop it Yeah I'm gonna do it again Yeah Again and again and again Yeah Always do that again Yeah Rap Onko moto fu na mali pel Dai des leg per ter Time I always thought Ti mo ter Always knew I'ma be the best Yeah Kana ki kwa le di pin In case you think it that Nte ki kwa lua Yeah Kana ki spana le wani In case you think it that Kya mani ji lo Kale ki tuka mo le Ki tuka mo le le di pin lo Yeah Then I learn what I taro. Get better comedy, my rap. Video let me give a fail. Get better go turn a little tempo. Get better go turn a telephone. Get spana kata da gitindo. 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 Gitindo, gitindo.
What a dope performance from William. Thank you so much. My personal favorite is Tinto, also because I love the video. Right now, let's receive the vote of thanks from Masscom CMO, Chief Marketing Officer, Reshimboy Khosimang. And that is how we wrap up the third edition of the Masscom Batanani Walk. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for participating. Thank you very much for all people who participated in this year's walk, either through walking or the various donations received. We are number one because of you at Mascom. Mascom, number one because of you.